Huge explosions rock Equatorial Guinea's main city. At least 17 people have been killed and more than 400 injured in a series of explosions at a military base in Equatorial Guinea, officials say. They say Sunday's blasts in the main city, Bata, were caused by stubble burning by farmers and negligence in the storage of dynamite at the base. Almost all buildings and homes in the city suffered huge damage, President Teodora Obiang Nguema said. State television showed people looking for survivors in the rubble. There are fears the death toll will rise further as some victims may be trapped. In a statement, President Obiang Nguema said the blasts had been caused by the negligence of a unit charged with the care and protection of stores of dynamite and explosives at the Nkuantoma military base. He said the base caught fire due to neighboring farmers clearing farming land by setting it alight, leading to the explosion. The president called for international aid. In a series of tweets, the health ministry said 420 injured people were being treated in hospitals and called for volunteer health workers to go to Bata Regional Hospital. The ministry also asked for urgent blood donations. Some hospitals have been overwhelmed by the number of patients admitted, State TV reported. It broadcast images of wounded people lying on the floor of a crowded hospital. Video of the aftermath of the explosions showed a chaotic scene with distressed people fleeing as smoke drifted over the area. We hear the explosion and we see the smoke, but we don't know what's going on, one local resident told AFP news agency. President Obiang Nguema has ruled Equatorial Guinea for 41 years. The country was a Spanish colony until independence in 1968. Despite riches in oil and gas, 76 of its 1.5 million people live in poverty, according to the UN and World Bank. The Spanish embassy said its nationals should remain at home and issued a series of emergency numbers. News taken from BBC. Please subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.